Good morning guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing, I can't believe it yet, another vlog. It's 8.14 in the morning, I'm just off to the center. I had this kind of wish for some very nice breakfast, so we're gonna visit one of the, in my honest opinion, best breakfast places here in, um, in Bratislava, which is called Mon Dieu. Guys, you know, you know me and uh, you know I love cars and especially BMWs, but if there is one car that's always, you know, has my it's going to be a G-Wagon and this is a very special one behind me. As you can see, this is the G500 squared, meaning that it's a, it's a much um, higher sitting G-Wagon. As you can see here, it's phenomenal comes only with the 500 engine at the moment so you can't get this one as a G63 I saw some conversions um, that you know uh, companies uh, like Haman and so on they offer or Brabus I think they offer a, a conversion of a G63 but the G500 plenty of power uh, I think around 400 something horsepower but just it looks ridiculous it looks like a truck and it drives like one for sure and with this orange paint scheme, I mean, it's just screaming, screaming for attention, isn't it? Anyway, so I just wanted to show you this one because it's absolutely beautiful. Stunning machine, the G500 squared. Okay guys, um, I just wanted to quickly share a couple of thoughts around the last vlog and the, um, the Chapman Brothers Runway Collection. A lot of you have been asking me on Instagram, a lot of you have been asking me on, on YouTube, um, you know, after I posted that video and if you didn't see the video, it's the video probably prior to that one, it's vlog number 10. You know, what did I get, what did I get? Well, you know, unfortunately, I didn't get nothing. The reason for this is that um, I had three items that I wanted to get um, for sure, like 100%, and th that was the two pocket organizers, the white and the blue one. Um, and I wanted to get the clutch PM, which is the one, the blue one with the lion, I guess. Um, and unfortunately, although the, the Vienna store got pretty much you know quite a lot of items I would say like 70% of what was released from the leather goods um, a lot of accessories a lot of clothes and you can see that in the video they did not get my three items okay so I had the three items as uh, you know 100% purchase um, plus I had one item that I wasn't 100% sure if I wanted and that was the steamer backpack the blue one with the um with the elephant unfortunately i couldn't see that one because they didn't have it as you saw in the video if you didn't saw um they had the white version with the rhino which is a great piece um but i'll probably not be buying you know the other one also i mean just 
and there's a big problem. I mean, the big challenge for me is that um, although one of the concerns that I had that this backpack doesn't have any pockets uh, is untrue. This backpack actually has po a pocket, an external pocket. I'm talking about external pockets for access to the keys and whatnot. Um, it has one in the back so when you put your hand like this in the back you can unzip it like this put your hand in and there's the pocket i actually like that it's in the back so it's concealed meaning that somebody cannot come from the back and grab something out of your pocket like for example my michael um but the biggest challenge for me is and if you see the pictures and i'll put some picture here of uh, you know me actually carrying the backpack you will see on this picture that um you know the backpack is riding very high on me and that's with uh, the straps extended at the far most length it's possible. So the straps are very, very short, especially for somebody who is my build. And you know, for your reference, I am 182 centimeters, around 105 kilos. There, there about. So I'm, you know, quite a chunky, bigger guy. And I can tell you, you know, the backpack is gonna sit very high. And that's, you know, just with this red polo shirt that I had on. Um, so I had a, a short sleeve white shirt and a. Uh, red polo long sleeve shirt that's that's what I had on on that picture as you can see and already with that the the backpack is absolutely high up on my shoulder now if I would have put a winter jacket on which I didn't try which it didn't make sense anyway th this would just you know be very very high and that's a big problem for me I mean it's a challenge because if I'm getting the backpack I'm getting the backpack to actually use it as a backpack And if I'm not able to use it as a backpack, then what's the point of getting it? Yes, okay, I could, you know, just tote it around by the handle, but that kind of beats the purpose of a backpack. And, you know, this piece is by no means cheap, you know, if you don't know, or you know already, it's 2,400 euro, that's the retail in Europe. I need to be very selective in, with my pieces. And it's one of the 2013 things, you know, that I'm doing. I'm really selective with what I'm getting, uh, meaning what I'm getting, I really need to use. And this piece, you know, it's, a bit delicate because of the leather construction on the top and the bottom that's gonna be like you know uh, it's gonna be delicate for sure from that perspective and that's the leather that you get on the Makassar bags or the uh, the cobalt one is like kind of this matte kind of softer leather so you know you need to be careful with it and you know the, the the fact that I can't comfortably you know it doesn't comfortably sit on me low enough it's just enough for me not to really get it um, so I kind of walked out with anything, you know, I didn't get anything. I was so disappointed um, I did pick up something from Gucci later on and you saw that in the you know in the video probably it's a pair of shoes and I'll or sneakers and I'll you know unbox that on another video so kind of you know something I got but you know when you get into that mood that you want something you're so excited you're waiting 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 you come there and they they tell you oh you know the three pieces that you want we don't have you know that was like I was like oh no but it is what it is, you know, I, I still commend the Louis Vuitton Vienna team, um, you know, Maria, Christian, um, is it Edin, I, you know, Beata, all, all the guys there, um, just, um, you know, just an amazing, amazing team. Um, so if you're ever in the vicinity of the Louis Vuitton Vienna store, do go there and, you know, do check them out. So I'm waiting now to see if they're going to give me a bus. I know this week till Monday, they're not going to have anything new, but maybe later on in the week, um, I might you know get my two pocket organizers hopefully um at my clutch but uh you know i rather wait out just for you know spending the money on something uh which i'm not gonna use and you know guys you know i'm not using wallets anymore and they had you know the marco the multiplayer the braza um you know i actually sold my braza a year and a half ago because i never ever almost used it i used it only when i traveled somewhere far and even for that you know kind of didn't take the passport so it, i you know it wasn't for me they had the large clutch organizer but you know i have my um uh volga you know and this thing just does everything for me holds you know all my items let me just quickly show you so i have the fendi card holder i have the key coin i have my car keys i have my apple airpods I have my six key from LV. I have some chopstick um, and I have some card in there. But that's, you know, you know what I'm saying? This is, and you know, price wise, this is like, I don't know how the, this was like 400 something euros. So it's quite affordable. It's, I mean, it's almost cheaper than some of the wallets. It is cheaper than some of the larger wallets. And that organizer basically kind of does what this does, but it costs 1000 something euros. So, you know, it was not for me. 
the bag we already discussed the steamer bag and across the shoulder bags i'll be honest with you guys the small ones and you know this medium one that were there they are nice you know they are something i would use but you know honestly speaking the price is a tad too much i think the small ones go for around 1200 something and the medium one is 1600 so if i would have splashed that kind of money i would add it to the steamer backpack um but because you know the fit is as it is um it's definitely you know it's definitely not for me so if you are you know you can be 182 centimeters like me for the steamer but you need to be slim um, or if you are shortened then uh, then you know it's gonna sit really proportionally on you I mean the size wise is good it just it rides up on the shoulders quite a lot so this is my you know six seven minute video around what I saw yesterday on the Louis Vuitton Chapman uh, you know collection lounge sale lounge in Vienna um, let's see if I get my three pieces uh, you know down the line I, I surely hope because in general I am in love 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 with this collection I think it's phenomenal it's something completely different um, I love the designs it's almost like kind of mythological looking animals it's for me it ticks all the boxes it's phenomenal and I just so so hope that I'm gonna get my hands on what I originally wanted to get the two pocket organizers the white and the blue one and the clutch PM with the line okay guys um, I'm off uh, for now this is it and I'll talk to you very very soon your favorite dress and I'm slipping glances looking for the patterns in static they start to make sense the more than 